Welcome back, folks. Today we are going to be playing around with Dublin a little bit. Uh, so an easy th thing that we can do for Dublin is deliver food. So we have uh, grain here, we have food production here. We can basically just put trucks on and we'll be delivering food to Dublin. So that is super easy, nice and convenient. And I want to get some passengers over to Dublin as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to put a harbor, a passenger harbor in Dublin and a passenger harbor in Liverpool and Manchester. And we're just going to have a ferry going between the two. So for now, those are the plans for today. Uh, let's see how far we get and um, and see if we if we can't get some other things done as well. Uh, so. Let's do a truck station. We just need one platform, 30 meters long. And we can stick that in there. Then we can do the same over here. And we need two platforms there. Actually, no, we just need one. Because we just need one uh, line. So there, and then we need a drop off. Uh, somewhere down here is where the food is. So let's put the drop off there. And that will get food to Dublin, basically. Uh, we need a uh, road depot. Uh, let's put that, put it out here. Then we need, uh, let, let's do the harbor, find out where that is going to be. Passenger harbor, just one. I think we could take passengers down to Amsterdam and Rotterdam as well, but let's just do one for now. We want it to be large, one terminal. And I kind of want it to be here. No, oh, that won't work. Okay. Then we'll put it here. Mm, something like that. We need a street going over and connecting to it. That's okay. We will smooth it out a bit so it doesn't have that. Okay, so that's fine. And I think we'll just do these uh, bus tram stops. Now, do we want to do trams in Dublin? I mean, we could. We could. Let's just connect that up. Uh, we want to connect this up to there. Yeah, we probably do. I don't mind the two buildings being removed so much. They'll come back. All right. I mean, we could do trams. Sure, why not? Let's do trams. Uh, we'll have a stop here. And we'll have a stop up here. And we'll have a stop up here. Um, out here, I think, and down here, and that will do. Uh, let's do uh, electric trams, and we will upgrade some roads. Like 
so. And there we have our tram route around Dublin. Alrighty. Let's get a tram depot. That can go in right here. So, all right, a new line from there to there to there to there to there, and that will be Dublin Circle. Well, Dublin Tram. We'll call it Dublin Tram, and then another new line going from there to there to there to there, to there. and that will be. Uh, Dublin um, one. Okay, so that line is in. Then we need another new line. Uh, actually, we need a. Did I put a? Didn't I put a cargo drop in here? I guess I didn't. We'll put it there. And then we can do this new line. And we'll do go from there to there. To there. And this will be Dublin Green to Food to Dublin. Okay, so that line is in, and then we need another harbor down here. I don't think I want more than one down here anyway, so let's just kind of want it like that. Okay, and then I want a road. No. To come off here. How's that look? Yeah. I think this is better. And we'll come off here. And we'll hook into there. And there we have that. And then we need a stop there. Oh, that's not the stop that I wanted. I want a passenger stop like that and then we need to fix the Manchester uh, bus lines and I think we might need to put some more vehicles on them eh, maybe not but we do need to fix the line so Liverpool Circle after the Crescent it goes to Kingsway so we'll add a station here and we'll go in there don't like that kind of need to move the Crescent over here or down here so let's put a bus stop in there and the crescent no longer exists so after King Street we'll add Alexander Road and then you go to King's Way why right, King's Way is not good uh, 
so we'll put in the stop down here and we'll remove King's Lane. Uh, or King's Way. The King's Way. But after Church Lane, we'll add Stanley Road. And then that looks fine. And we need to do the same here. So... Let's see, we're going Liverpool and Manchester sidings to King Street to Church Road to New Street to Green Lane. After Green Lane, we are not going to Kingsway. Uh, we're going to Stanley Road, then to Church Lane, and then not to the Crescent, but to Alexander Road. And that'll be fine. Okay. So those are in. Then we need to buy some vehicles. Uh, let's let the game play on. Uh, so Dublin Tram Depot. Uh, we'll buy... I think we'll buy the Manx Electric. Now let's do these guys and we'll buy one and put you on Dublin Tram and we'll buy another and put you on Dublin Tram 1. Okay, they're going. Then here we need to buy some trucks. Uh, you can't do food. You can do all cargo. So we'll buy by twelve. And what color is that line? Whoa. Uh, is it this one? I think it's this one. We'll make them that one. And this will be Dublin grain to food to Dublin. Okay. So we're starting to see grain standing. And then we need a new line going from there to there. And this will be Dublin, uh, Liverpool and Manchester. Let's actually shorten this down a bit. Uh, we'll do Dub Live Man Ferry. Okay. And let's buy some vehicles for that. We want a passenger ferry, a Frontenac. Klondike. I, I do like the Klondike, but it's not very European. We could do the steamship ferry. I kind of like the idea of doing the steamship ferry and just having one on there. Let's do that. Uh, let's see, you need to be that color. And we'll just have the one on there for now. And the game is complaining a little bit. I want to see this ferry, but we'll take a look at it a little bit later once it gets over to its route, I think. Uh, so that's all good. Now up here in Glasgow, we have a lot of people waiting for the tram or for the bus. Not so many here, but there are actually some waiting here as well. So I think I want to get one more on there. Uh, 
Because there are quite a lot of people waiting. So I think one more would be good. Uh, down here, we also have some people waiting, at least in one direction. The Liverpool Circle, Liverpool Circle. Uh, here's the Liverpool Circle 1, Liverpool Circle 1. Nobody. Nobody, but that's kind of to be expected. Uh, Liverpool Circle. And in here, we don't really have anyone. But I think maybe putting one more vehicle on could be good, but we'll give it a little bit of time. Down here in London, uh, how are we looking? This looks fairly good. London Circle, London Circle, London Circle 1, London Circle 1. All right, and what about that in here? So London Circle could probably do with another vehicle. Uh, managed. I didn't want to manage the line. I wanted to manage the vehicles. Uh, so let's get one more bus on there. Okay. And at the train station, we have a lot of passengers waiting, going, going both directions, which is fantastic. Uh, and up here we have a decent amount going both directions. Up here we also have a decent amount going. So if we can find a train, there's one coming into the station here in London now. Train 20. It's obviously going to be full. So how many trains do we have on this now? I think we'll get one more. Because we, we definitely need it. Uh, Paris will start having yeah a lot of people waiting to go as well. And I actually think instead of connecting up Bordeaux to Marseille or Lyon, we'll connect it up to Paris and bring Paris down to Bordeaux, Barcelona, Madrid, and then another train line, Lisbon, Sevilla, Madrid, or actually probably go Paris, Bordeaux, Barcelona, and then have an inter-Iberian Peninsula train line going uh, Lisbon, Seville, Madrid, Barcelona. Yeah. Or actually, I think we'll go Paris, Bordeaux, Madrid, because Madrid is the capital. So... That could be a thing. All right. Let's see. Do we have passengers for the ferry? We do, actually. 33 passengers waiting. Seven passengers waiting. Okay. Well, that's good. And we have a lot of grain sitting here. No food, I suspect. Well, one. I think we need some more uh, some more trucks on this. And let's just see. A lot of people going to the ferry. Look at that. That is awesome. Look at all these people waiting for the ferry. That is fantastic. Whoops. And what what's this one called? Liverpool and Manchester Port, Port Good. And over here we still only have seven people waiting, but seven is better than none. And Oh, there comes another one. Outstanding. Uh I think these need to where are you going now what are you on you're on Liverpool circle one where are you going oh you're going in there okay
All right, well, that's probably fine. Where's our ferry? It's coming over there. We'll still wait a little bit to take a look at it until we have some more, uh, have some people on board, I think. Um, so yeah, I think the next project is going to be getting uh, Paris hooked up to Bordeaux. And then I'm kind of thinking that because Seville and Barcelona want food. So we could do grain down to this food processing and then have food going up to Barcelona. And I'm thinking that we'll do both cargo and and uh, passenger trains together here for the stations. I think that makes sense. And in, in Madrid, I'm thinking that we'll do an underground station as well. Or again, like we had in London. That's my plan for now. And we'll simply take grain over to Lisbon food, take the food to Lisbon, and then we'll train it to Seville and Barcelona. And maybe we'll, and we'll probably put a port in Barcelona so that we can take food over to Milan, maybe. I think that would make sense. And then I have another plan for this oil down here. So we'll get crude going up to this uh, Skikta refinery. Then we'll save, sail it over here to the Syracuse fuel. And then we'll sail it up to Rome and to Marseille and probably to Barcelona port as well to get it into Madrid. That's my plan anyway. That is my plan. All right, let's take a look here. We have a lot of tools sitting here. So let's see. What vehicle do we have on here? The DMG guns. So let's replace all these. Uh, this doesn't do tools, so it'll be with this. And let's replace you. That'll make it quite a bit better. We do have a lot of uh, tools sitting here as well, so let's replace you as well. Wow, that ship is having some issues. So that will be better. Uh, how much fuel are you bringing in? 22. How much fuel do you need? And do you have 95 of 112? That's not bad. And you should have a well, decent amount of tools. Uh, Liverpool and Manchester do with way more tools. Uh, and some more bricks, actually. Uh, do we have do we have things sitting here? We just need to transport more. But we don't really have bricks sitting here. But that might just be because of the rate of the line, 118. And we want 150. So what vehicles do we have on this? Also the DMG Gunstat. Uh, so let's replace these as well. This is uh, bricks, so we could do the or the construction materials. So let's do those. And let's have a quick look at you. Just a little peek, if I can hit one of them. Right, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. And what did that do to the rate? 190. So that's too much. So let's sell you. And that takes us down to 175. That's actually too much as well. So let's uh, sell you. 
And that takes us down to a rate of 160. That's perfect. Okay. This port is just so busy. I kind of think I want to just take this down a bit. Game does not like that. Just to make it a little bit easier to get in and out of this port. Okay. So our ferry is up here. It is 11 passengers on board. I would have liked more, but man, this is a cool ship. It's a big ship. This is a really cool ship. I like it. That is very, very cool. Beautiful ship. Beautiful ship. And how many passengers do we have over here now? 79. We won't even get them all, but of course it has had a while to fill up. So it'll get... Uh, we probably won't make money for on this line for a long, long time. We have a rate of 165 and a frequency of six minutes. But it isn't, hasn't been very expensive in running costs. It really hasn't. All right, so it's full. And how many people do we have waiting here? Nine now? Are people flooding in? Well, there are some coming. And some leaving. I think it's pretty darn good. Alright. So that's basically UK done. Except that we want uh, to get some uh, machinery to Dublin as well at some point. But that's something that'll just have to wait for now. That's something that'll just have to wait for now. Now, looking at this, so what do we have? We have a lot of coal stored. We have a lot of coal stored. What we could do is put a harbor up here and get these two delivering iron over here as well. That could be a possibility. Get some more shipping going from uh, from Norway over to, to the UK. But anyway... Uh, yeah, I think uh, we achieved what we wanted today. We got the port going. Wow, look at that. 49 passengers, 50 passengers. And how many do we have on board now? Eight. So it's going to be a problem over on this side. Uh, uh, making money. But from Dublin over to Liverpool and Manchester, that's certainly not a problem. Uh, we have... Oh, only eight passengers there. Ah, oh, there's just been a train, so that's understandable. 124 wanting to go to London. How many do you have on board? 23. Okay. And in London, we have a lot of passengers. A lot, a lot, a lot of passengers. It is a big city. 785. 439. And Glasgow is 350. And what's Paris? Paris is pretty big too. I have 414, so it's not that big. 
it's not that big. Brussels, 393, Amsterdam, 601. What is the biggest town? London. London is by far the biggest town. Okay. Well, we are getting some uh, passenger connections to a lot of the towns, so that's good to see. That is good to see. Yeah, I like it. London needs a lot more food. So we want to get more grain going down here. This is completely full. So what we could do is connect up the Denmark farm too and get that going down here as well. And I think we might do that because the road isn't congested. It's just the deliveries up here that are congested. And what are you producing now? You're actually at 600 and that's your max. So what is our rate on this line? 493. And we can't really get more unless are we on the we are on the DMG Gunstat as well here. So if we replace that with the Benz Tarpaulin. And then we can probably sell like at least five. I'm I'm gonna say ten. Let's sell you. And uh, what's your rate now? Five sixteen. We'll see. That'll adjust. So we want it to have a rate of around 600, if we can get it there. Uh, these uh, roads... Uh, where do we see... How do we see speeds? Can we see speeds? We can't see speeds of roads, but this is a... Now that's one of those. It has a limit of 40, so that's fine. But I'm thinking that once these trucks spread out a bit, our rate will go up. Yeah, look at that. So getting this going as well would be outstanding. So that's probably our first order of business, or maybe I'll just set it up in between episodes because you, you don't really need to see that. How is Hamburg doing for food? Uh, it's doing okay. You've got 26, so getting more food going here would be outstanding. That would be really, really good. So that's what we're going to do, I think. So yeah, uh, I'll set that up in between episodes, that'll also deliver more food to London, it'll make our uh, shipping line more profitable, and everyone will be super happy. So that sounds good to me. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.